Matt Bruno, this is nutrition and traveling for history. I'm at Prospect Cemetery today in East Middlebury, Vermont. I have been looking for different men who have served during the American Civil War, and I've been having some pretty good luck doing just that. And this man in front of us, let's zoom in for you, William L. Bel Belknap was one of these men. So, let me share with you some information about him. He was born on January 23, 1836 in Springfield, Vermont. He enlisted on August 14, 1862, mustered in October 4, 1862, as a private with Company G, 12th Vermont Infantry, mustered out on July 14, 1863. Now, there was a pension applied for on November 11, 1905, and he would have received that either because he was he became disabled due to um, things that happened during the the uh, uh, war, or he became destitute. Those are usually the two reasons um, someone could apply for a pension with the federal government. So he served with the Grand Army of the Republic, which was the Union side of the war. Then after he died, his widow Harriet would have would have had to prove that she was actually married to him. And she would have received it until she died, which was February 11, 1915. He died on January 16, 1915. So she died just less than a month after he did. I do have his obituary here that I'm going to read to you. This was posted in the Middlebury Register from Middlebury, Vermont, on Friday, January 22, 1915. Quote, William L. Belknap died in his home in this village on Saturday morning from the effects of a shock at the age of 79 years. Mr. Belknap came to this village about 35 years ago and engaged in the milling business, erecting the grist mill now in operation. He was a veteran of the Civil War, having served in the 12th Vermont Volunteers. A wife survives him. Funeral services were held at his late home on Monday afternoon at 2 o'clock. Reverend John Evans Bold, rector of St. Stephen's Episcopal Church at Middlebury, officiating. The bearers were Thomas Reed, J.A. Douglas, W.H. Olmsted, and C.E. Russell. The interment was in the family lot in Prospect Cemetery. I have a bonus for you. I found a photograph of what he looked like in 1891. So a group from Company G, 12th Vermont Volunteer Infantry, attended a reunion in Brandon, Vermont on August 22, 1891. So let me show you his photograph. Um, in fact, let me go ahead and walk up here to his, his uh, headstone. We can see, by the way, uh, that uh, he served in Company G, Vermont Infantry, 1836-1915, his wife Harriet A. Bentley, 1860, but it doesn't have her death date on here, which is also 1915, as you may recall. All right, so I apologize right now. There is a brisk wind today, but um, all right. And this man right here, right here, this was William Belknap. I found this on the uh, Vermont and the Civil War website, and uh, anyway, it's so fascinating. This is Patricia, and I'm traveling for history. If you like my content, please subscribe to my channel, follow me on social media, my photographs always go up on Instagram and uh, Facebook, so you can see them there, and they go up shortly before an hour or so before I post the 
to um, uh, before the video is live. All videos go live at 12:30 a.m. Thanks so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. Until I see you again, thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye now.